This is the half ounce silver proof uh, coin, the one pound denomination coin. It's in the acrylic block and the price on this one is 65 pounds. But obviously there's three in the series. The next two are due in, I believe, May and June. Anyway, the point being is that uh, here it is. It's arrived. It's the one pound denomination silver proof or half ounce silver proof coin from the series. Let's have a look at it. I'll just uh, take out the incriminating evidence from the packaging and uh, here we go. So <clears throat> we have a Bond coin. This is pretty speedy delivery considering it was only released yesterday. This is the, I don't know if you can see actually, the half ounce silver proof coin. So let's open the thing. Slip case. There's the box. With the 007 logo. So they put it in the box upside down. Or well, perhaps they put the box in upside down. Yeah. This is a little bit difficult, so have a look and take it out of the box. So that's not a good start. Let's put that right. There, there we are. That's the coin. Let's get a close up look at it, shall we? Is the close up one James Bond tagline on the coin? Okay, so let's just have a look at what the booklet comes with and um, says, comes with it, says. This is uh, Sean Connery. So, Sean Connery was the first actor to play James Bond, starring in Doctor No in 1962, according to the information here. But there was another, there was another actor, I think, that played him. I'm not a aficionado with. Uh, James Bond. But I think there was another actor that played him, but it wasn't an official um, Bond movie. So these are all the sort of this is all the information on the history of James Bond, basically. Um, and also a few photos. Now here's the designers. Now they aren't, I believe. Uh, Royal Mint designers, they work in parallel with the Royal Mint designers, but uh, yeah, so some, some people I've seen not liking the designs a lot. Um, I'm not sure that um, oops, back in the right way. Yeah, some people not liking the design a great deal. I'm not saying it's a bad design myself, but uh, yeah, I think there was a bit of a, a lost opportunity in some respects. But having said that, it is a very classic, very classy design. Very simple, but uh, yeah, not to everybody's taste, but then that's to be expected. Not every coin you know, is going to appeal to everybody. And uh, is the standard 
Lady Clark portrait. Everybody knows that one now. But I think the, the design itself is quite, uh, quite classy. Now obviously, to get the best effect, the idea is that you have all three coins in the series. So that is a bit of a negative in some respects, because obviously it encourages people to buy more than they necessarily want. Um, and I'm not sure in the long term that does the Royal Mint or the series any favours. But of course, you know, it is, this one is only silver, so it's not going to break the bank entirely. Obviously, as long as you've got the money available. But it's not the price of the I don't know if you've if you've heard but they did release a five kilogram gold coin which is priced at around about half a million pounds so in comparison this is pocket money or pocket change it's not a great deal of money in that respect and these were definitely conceived and designed to be premium coins there was never any chance that these would be in circulation. As you can see, the design itself, that's the, I believe, anyway, that's the, I'm not, as I said, an aficionado, but I believe that's the um, Aston Martin. It's synonymous, synonymous, if I could say the word, with Bond. Um, yeah. I mean, it's the first in a series, basically. We'll wait and see, see how things go, see how things look. Um, it comes, obviously, with that little booklet. The um, acrylic casing, again, quite stylish. And, obviously, it comes in the box with the um, certificate of authentic authentication, authentication even, if I could say it. I'll give you a look once again at the specifications. Maximum coin mintage, 15,017, but not in this presentation. That's 15,007. Not sure where the other 10 coins are going. But also note that it's only three nines silver, not four nines doesn't really make that much difference to the value but just just as a by the by anyway that's the coin thanks for tuning in don't forget there's more to come and i'll be back next time oh and don't forget i'm doing a giveaway so if you want to be in, a ch in with the chance of winning some coins not this one but if you want to be in with the chance of winning some coins or um at any time, not just on this giveaway, but on any at any time. Don't forget to subscribe, don't forget to like, comment, and do all the usual things, basically. And I'll see you next time. Thanks for tuning in. Bye. Doop.